I declare uh, this cycle officially open. Thank you very much. I, I honestly feel like today for me this was a, was quite a revelation. Uh, we can go and do some design review um, and, uh, and really and truly make a commitment. The conversation has begun. It is the right conversation and anything that is anchored on policy um, is, is, is good because we can start to hold people to account why we don't have bus stops, why we don't have street furniture, why are you designing a road without a cycle lane? Why is a cycle lane not two meters? Uh, and all those things now start to come into place. We must be bold enough to fight for the space of NMT. It is critical that we have NMT facilities that are well designed, that will allow people to walk to the terminals and back to their homes. We need to see that those corridors are pretty safe. Uh, at the intersections, we saw that. We saw a lot of debris in the other side. But for Kura, what I would advocate, that section really, we should start working on it. We are working together with your team, coming from uh, CBD in Kenyatta Avenue, um, along that area. So we really want to ensure that we'll have a two-meter corridor. Uh, for us who are in policy making, we really need to entrench uh, the whole concept and as we plan for our roads uh, we really need to think globally this experience today and tied to the planning element is very 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 important we're committed to work on the other initiatives like the bike share I think it's really inspiring that the you know the PS is behind that idea as well um, we also want to get the street design manual moving and, and I think we'll be reaching out to Kura Kenha NMS very soon to get your feedback on the updated version so that we can get that uh, manual on the way toward adoption. Uh, you and I be that we are advocating for shift. We should shift from uh, private car to uh, public transport and also to uh, NMT because by cycling, by going to work, by cycling, we really uh, not only um, reduce our time in traffic, but we also improve our health. So the experience of today is really something that it's, it's the starting. It's something that we really need to continue doing it. I hope that um, all of you will continue cycling and you know one bicycle ride here and there can change a lot so keep riding and keep inspiring other people to cycle especially our policy makers you know when you wear a shoe you know where it pinches when you design a road and you don't go and experience the road the way the end user will experience it you will never get to understand the challenges the end user actually faces